There is nothing better than a helping hand when you desperately need it. And when dealing with cancer, that desperation comes more often than patients would like. But Beverly Taylor reports tonight on a free service that's taking a lot of the burden off some women undergoing cancer treatment. This little yellow car comes with a lot more than people. The ladies inside come armed, armed with cleaning supplies. And when MPS Elementary School teacher Tiffany Peters comes home, Let's go. seeing the ladies is a welcome relief. Oh, Tiffany is undergoing cancer treatment, and after teaching energetic first graders all day, cleaning her house is just a bit much. It makes me tired. Um, the side effects are fatigue, um, sometimes a little nauseous, dizzy. Um, yeah, pretty much tired is the big thing. Well, no fear. The Maid's Home Service, ready to combat dust, dirt, and grime, is here for free. The service is partnering with Cleaning for a Reason, a nonprofit organization that sets up donated cleaning services for women undergoing cancer treatments. Wonderful. I felt, I almost felt guilty <laughs> being home and not cleaning my house and have someone else do it. It's been a blessing. Very helpful. Sue Perenboom, owner of the Maids Home Service franchise out of Menominee Falls, says she is blessed to be a blessing. Well, it's personal uh, for me as well. My my husband Pete is a 20-year-old cancer survivor this year of uh, non-Hodgkin's lymphoblastic lymphoma, and he was stage four. Perenboom says the maids strive to take some of the physical and financial toll off the cancer patients they serve. Tiffany got hooked up with them after friends and family advised her to check out the Cleaning for a Reason website. It explained how the Texas-based foundation used insured and or bonded services that take a minimum of two patients at a time and give four free cleanings, one a month for four months. I, I never can get my sink this clean. Where it shines, never. She filled out the application and was accepted in less than a week. We uh, wanted to, to help other women just have less stress while they're going through the process and just giving them um, a little joy. Tiffany found a lump in her breast doing a self-exam, had surgery in October, and now chemotherapy and eventually radiation. In their special way, the maids help her deal with something she never thought she'd face. It's overwhelming. The whole thing that you're going through? Yes. But thanks to cleaning for a reason, yeah. Tiffany can take the time and limited energy she would have spent on cleaning Were you almost sleeping? and give it to her two-year-old son. <laughs> and in no time, the maids have finished cleaning and are packed up, leaving behind a clean environment for Tiffany to heal and love on her little one. Now, there is no shortage of women undergoing cancer treatment who need the program. The problem is there is a shortage of volunteer maid services to meet the demand. So if you are a licensed maid service and would like to donate time, go to cleaningforareason.org and sign up or simply go to our website and we'll provide the link. If you are a cancer patient, you can also apply at the same place. Live in the newsroom, Beverly Taylor, Fox 6 News. It has just got to take so much off their plate just to have that set of chores done and the time to rest and recuperate, which is so valuable for those cancer patients. Yeah, it's less to worry about. Oh, great idea. Good yeah. for them, Bev. Thank you. Sure.